Terrible. Okay, guys, welcome to the second National Assembly. I'm gonna get on uh, Minecraft real quick, and then uh, I'm gonna get to talking about uh, some of the new things I was thinking about and all that jazz. And then I'll handle questions like during or after um, finished. So it was kind of a spare the moment meeting, but it's recorded, so everyone can see. So it's all good. Does my Minecraft look a little fast. <clears throat> Um, Kaiser and Doc, uh, you can raise your hands to, to speak to because I know um, we were talking about a few things that you guys might, might want to talk about. Oh, wow. Okay, guys, I'm assuming everyone's already in the church. Oh, UW. <laughs> okay. What is this? So I don't think you idiot. Okay, so I don't know where Doc is or um, or any of the other other people. Well, uh, you know they're in the Discord, so it's all that all that matters. I'm just gonna go over a few things. Like um, first thing on the agenda is probably talking about uh, taxes. Um, I was thinking like I haven't come up with uh. A fixed rate yet but I was gonna make it like a fixed rate for each town and each person so therefore like we don't have to keep like recalculating taxes every time like a new person joins like if we made it like real life and it scaled to population and all that it would just get messy so we should probably just like, edit it like just make it a fixed rate for every few people like say like if your town has 10 people then each person would have to pay a certain amount if it paid 20, you know, it would go up. Just some, something like that, basically. I'm going to make um, some rates and then have a vote on it, like, in the King's Council. And maybe get some input from a few of the citizens. But that's how I was going to do taxes. You know, it wasn't going to be too much. Just to make sure the, the state itself has money and it can give money to each department and just keep money for, for like further use because right now the money is kind of divided up between all the towns and provinces and people it's kind of just floating around and it could be used more efficiently if the state was using it than rather like five different people doing like one thing you know what i mean second thing um was like establishing like departments like for the government like i was going to make like a like a potions department where they would just solely like focus on like potions you know they would have like their hq and work on potions for like war and stuff or just to sell and then i was gonna have like an arms department where we're just focus on like enchanting or just making armor and stuff and uh, like in the builders guild of course which i would like they would all get certain like real life they would all get a certain amount of money annually as a budget 
and they would use that to fuel their um their work like the builders guild like we can't just have them going around and collecting materials themselves like we give them money i do push it um you could probably join kaiser because he already has like a lab and we were going to up upgrade it to the like a proper like hq so you guys could probably work on that um what else yeah the like i was talking about the builders guild that need, like i was we, that needs more refinement like right now you know it's just kind of a few people building but i was thinking that we just do it like how we've been doing kind of like the the builders guild looks in the infrastructure check whatever is pinned or if they got a dm from like a town leader or something or a province leader then they would focus on those constructions rather like building things randomly like just like random houses and stuff we give them assignments and then they'll build, build that and then they would have a certain budget so they could buy like different materials and stuff so they don't have to run around and get it themselves so i was as a few things i just wanted to say anyone else has like questions or concerns you can uh raise your hand and i'll uh, i'll put you up here Nobody? <laughs> tough crowd, tough crowd. Okay, let me just think about something else. That we... Oh, yes. Um, we're getting to that point where, you know, we're getting a lot of people. You know, everyone, everyone has armor and all that. You know, we're getting closer and closer to, like, a more established nation. So I think we should start talking. Like, maybe we don't have to finalize anything yet, but we should start putting in the works military organization and how we're gonna do on that and like start appointing like soldiers and all that like proper soldiers because right now the nation is basically just ran off levies like if war would happen we would just mobilize <laughs> a certain amount of people rather than having like a standing like professional army which we should probably start doing soon okay looks like fanta had something to say with that all right fanta it up here. You have to accept it and invite you to speak. Alright. Um, so, you were talking about the uh, military stuff. And I was thinking, I would be a volunteer soldier. Also, I'd be a volunteer um, builder if you ever had a huge project and you needed help. Um, I also was thinking, if you needed someone to make and like sell uh arms i could help with that too okay i'll um uh there's a like a huge like castle that we're building if you go to the infrastructure chat and the pin they probably need help on that but when we establish the arms department and stuff i'll uh i'll contact you all right, all right. okay Anyone else? Or is this going to be a, a quickie today? Quick meeting. I keep accidentally clicking on my head. Okay. You have to accept an invite, by the way. There you go. I didn't. Weren't you guys talking about also working out trade in this meeting too yeah um i don't know like i don't have like potential trade partners but we could do but i'm i mean if you guys have any ideas you know throw them up but i was thinking that we need to start trading with other countries like sooner now because you know we're more established now and we don't really need to keep funding our resources into like one place we can trade away a few stuff you know we have a a lot of biomes and a lot of stuff that like other places around the world wouldn't have so it would just help build like friendly relations and, and get us more money who doesn't like money so if you guys have any ideas of countries like potential trading partners just let me know i will be talking to a few nation leaders about it but for now i don't have any like Satin stone trading partners. 
but I was thinking maybe Red or Riv or like maybe Pete, like people across the net maybe that don't have the same biomes as us. It would make sense. All right. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Unless anyone has anything else to say, I think that's pretty much it for for this one. It was kind of a quick one, you know. Oh, Jordy's in here. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait. Wait a second. I've been trading goods with Shuriken as a. Yeah, they're 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 a biggie. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're a biggie. They've they've been buying all like the crops and stuff. Uh, Jordy came in and then dipped out. Uh, okay. Guess he didn't feel like he said anything. All right, so yeah, you should probably talk to Shira Kineza about getting like a like a contract or something, like a set amount of like wheat or like seeds or whatever that you sell to them every so often. Uh, oh, that's cool. The meeting is gonna be over by the time we get home. Anyway, um, I think that's it. I will put out like a form for the taxes. Like later today, like I'll I'll draft it up in a like a f I'll make a few proposals and we'll um see what the best one is. It's not going to be anything too crazy. Yeah, and um, I'll talk with the builders guild whenever they get on to get um to organize them more, so we could finish a lot of projects quickly. Because like other provinces like Lease and Blackheart need a few people, and I know Doc needs a few people. So, so does um, so does Jordy. Like, yeah, we need to, we need to start splitting them up. So that's that's it for today. You know, it wasn't wasn't really a big one like the first national assembly. You know, it's not always going to be a huge thing to unpack. That was just uh, that was just it. So, you know, everyone everyone can go. If you have any like further questions, just just pop it in the citizens chat. Other than that, that's uh, that's it for today.